Well, Joseph James joins us now. And Joseph, I know it's still winter, but winter's going out with a bang. Today, the weather yeah. was all over the place. It sure is, especially if you're in those higher elevations. Right, yeah. Snowfall, even a little bit of snow trying to make it to the valley floor. Just trying. It's trying, to get especially there. for the morning commute, which would not be good for us. Yes, yes, which would definitely slow things down. We had some snowfall in areas of Salem. The radar right now picking up on precipitation through the valley. It could be a little bit of a busy start for your morning commute, depending on if we see some snowfall through the lower valley at this time. I don't think it's going to quite reach the floor, which is good news for the morning commute. But if you're in those higher elevations, it's definitely possible. Snowfall through the Cascades, as well as the coast range, the central coast range. If you're pushing down towards areas like McMinnville into the higher elevations there, that's where all of this heavier snow has been over the last few hours. Rain for Portland down to Lake Oswego, Clackamas. We've had some Reports of snowfall at Eagle Creek, elevation about 700, 750, give or take. And that is going to be consistent through the overnight. It's going to be those type of areas, if you live a little bit higher, where you could pick up on some snowfall. I think it'll be about 1,000 feet, though, where actually sticks will have some accumulation, about an inch or so. So satellite radars would take a wider view, some cold air moving in, still some moisture. It's going to be very active over the next a few days. It continues into tomorrow, Tuesday. And Wednesday. This is what I'm thinking with the snow forecast if you haven't picked up on it quite yet. Uh, snow to the floor is uh, not likely. We'll see minor accumulation at the most, uh, but I'm going to go with no. It's going to be very similar to this morning. A better chance is once you get too close to about 500 feet and then sticking snow about 1,000 feet up to about an inch, maybe a little bit more than that. I'll have some updates on social media if you do want to follow me along there. Setting on past though, snowfall right now as well as up at Government Camp on US 26. The snow is over the roads. Again, maybe pick Picking up a few more inches through the overnight. Portland today, nothing but showers. You can see the waves of rain moving through. There's one right there about 8 o'clock. And then we had some clearing and then some more rain. So very scattered. And that's what we're noticing right now here at 11 o'clock. Some wet roads. And that will probably be likely as we go into tomorrow morning too. So overnight about 34 degrees. A rain snow mix is possible. But again, uh, the wind is running out of the south. Southwest that could keep temperatures up a little bit warmer. Sending the kids off to the school bus tomorrow. Tomorrow. Just get them prepared and get them ready for a little bit of rain. Temperatures right around 32 to 36 degrees. And then riding home, it's going to be warmer. Maybe some sun breaks out there too, but uh, still a chance for some rain showers for the afternoon as well. So rain and cloud forecast as we go through the overnight. Notice that we do have the spotty showers trying to pick up on some snowfall come tomorrow morning. And that could, again, reach down to the valley floor. I think it's a little unlikely, but if we do see some, it shouldn't affect your morning commute too much. Afternoon, some scattered showers from the coast all the way through the Cascades and onto the east side of the state. Uh, that will be on and off through our Monday evening and night, too. And then look at this. We can't catch a break. We're dry for maybe about 10 minutes, and then rain returns as we go into Tuesday morning and into Tuesday afternoon. Heavy precipitation could likely pick up a good dose of rain as we go into our Tuesday afternoon. So coastal forecast for tomorrow in the 40s. Scattered showers, snow about 500 feet. 40s through the I-5 corridor. Again, snow right around 500 feet. As we look forward in time, uh, temperatures in the upper 40s starting to warm up to about 50 degrees on Wednesday. A week from today, the sunset will be at 7 o'clock. We're springing forward. So that's something we can look forward to next week. Yeah, and you said it best. We can't catch a break right now. <laughs> no, we sure can. It's been so wet all February, now right. we're piggybacking into March, same thing. But I just looked, two more weeks of winter, so let's hope when spring starts, we get the flowers and all that. So. All the good stuff. All right, cool yeah. stuff. Well, let's talk about sports.